Hey guys, it's Lori. I'm about to work on a project and I thought I'd share it with you. I went shopping for some craft supplies at the cemetery. What? <laughs> I did, I was walking around the cemetery and I found some craft supplies. We got neighbor dogs and my dog out, so <laughs> they bark at each other. I got these sticks. They're pretty good sized. I'm gonna cut one of them down and just kind of share. I'm gonna do a voiceover, how's that? That's what I'll do. There's really not much to say with a voiceover, so you know what, I'm just gonna leave it here. I'm just gonna let you see what I'm doing. I'm cutting it, that's it. So, there you go. So I came back inside. I really just wanted to cut the sticks outside. So I figured I'd do my intro out there, but then the neighbor dogs came out and everything got loud and that's okay. Glue gun. I'm just kind of showing you guys some of my supplies that I'm gonna be using. And this isn't necessarily exactly what I'll be using. I just kind of get things out and I kind of decide, Winston, there's a lot of people next door, so he's, Kind of going nuts, hang on. Okay, hopefully he won't bark the entire rest of the time or I'll have to do the voiceover, like I said. Anyway, which isn't a huge deal. I just, I don't know. I just prefer to just speak. I might use some E6000, probably will. Scissors, these are my glue sticks in here. So I know I'm gonna need those. And I'm going to use some of this twine right here. And it's just the decorative nautical rope from Dollar Tree. To be honest with you, I'm showing you this, but I'm actually gonna use this, but it this isn't open yet. And the bigger roll is open, and I don't know where I got the bigger roll, but look, they are like the same. So I'm just saying you can use this from the Dollar Tree. I'm going to use this witch's hat, as well as these super glittery, frilly things right here. I'm gonna be using these. Maybe, 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 the, maybe this. I might tear this apart and use this hat. I'm not sure about that one yet. We'll see. Okay, I'm gonna get started and kind of show you guys what I'm doing as I go. Just gonna check out this witch's hat. See what it looks like out of the package. That's actually super cool, you guys. That is really cool. You could totally stuff something up in there. That is really a cool looking witch's hat. Totally is. Okay, so this is gonna work really well. I set this aside for now. Get these babies out, because this is what we're gonna use kind of first. So super glittery though. They really are. Look at all that glitter that came off loads of glitter on these. I'm gonna real quick take these tags off. I should have had that done ahead of time. Let me get that done real quick. Train! I'm getting totally covered in glitter. I'm gonna run outside and spray these with some hairspray real quick. I'll be back. All right, so I just took those out and put hairspray on them. This Dollar Tree Salon Selectives hairspray. Doesn't smell too bad, <laughs> but look at this. This stuff is hairsprayed hair onto my hands. So look at that. Hopefully it sticks to the little frilly things as well as it's sticking to my hands. And I'm really glad I have some lava soap. <laughs> yeah, so much glitter. I'll be back after I clean up this mess. Okay, that is a million times better. I think it's still gonna lose a little bit of glitter, but nothing like it was before, for sure. So, I'm gathering these all together like this, 
and just putting a rubber band around them so that they look like this. That's what I'm gonna do with these black ones too. Set those to the side. Just kind of gather them up like this. And this project, um, if anybody else has a video on this and you guys know of it, please let me know because I have not seen another video on this. I was looking through Pinterest and I saw something similar to what I'm making and uh, I didn't even look at the tutorial. I just looked at the photo and I'm kind of going off that. So I'm really not trying to steal anybody's total, you know, craft or whatever, procedure, process, whatever you want to call it. But uh, I'm, I always give credit where it's due, so I'm just saying. I don't have any idea whose picture it was on Pinterest or anything. I just, I saw it, I'm like, that's awesome. And I made, I'm making it, so I've never made this before. My first time making it. That's what I want that to look like. That's what I want that to look like. Now I need a stick. And let's see, I want the shorter stick. With the purple, yeah. The shorter stick with the purple frillies. I don't know what you call these things, so I'm just calling them frilly things. All right, now I'm gonna glue it on here. So can you see that I'm making a broom? I'm making a witch's broom. <laughs> There's gonna be his and hers. That's what I'm doing. All right, so I got my glue gun all plugged in and ready to go. I'm just gonna take some hot glue and actually, you know what, let me get my, um, E6000 ready to go too, so because I'm going to use some of that too. Some hot glue and some E6000. And let's see, where do I want the hot glue? Right here. Some hot glue. Squish out some E6000 in between the hot glue dots. like that and press that baby down hold on to it until that hot glue is set all right so that's kind of gonna hold it still but I'm gonna put a little more hot glue over here and I'm gonna put some more on this side too I'm just gonna do it real quick if I'm going to be holding one side, I might as well be holding the other side at the same time. <laughs> I sometimes might use a little too much hot glue, but I like to make sure it's not going anywhere. So, and yes, I'm going to put more than that on. So, all right, now I have a whole bunch of hot glue on here. It's still sort of sticky, but anyway, I'm going to use some of this twine or you can use the stuff from Dollar Tree. Either way is fine. I cut a pretty good sized piece off. I want to wrap quite a bit of it around here. So. Press that down, wait for it to cool off. Okay, something that's really hard for me to do is, or I should say not to do, is not to mess with the hot glue stringies until I'm done. Just don't mess with them. <laughs> at least with this project it's okay they kind of look like cobwebs we're still getting a lot of fallout though can you see that but that's all right all right so I may finish this off camera so that I can get a little better angle on it but I'm just gonna wrap it around I'm going up a little bit and I'm just gonna keep wrapping until this is covered All right, so I didn't cut it quite long enough. Not a big deal. I'll just take off another piece and keep going. But I've burnt myself a couple times, so I'm gonna try my finger protectors out. Cause I mean, if you can avoid burning yourself, why not? If you got them, use them, right? Never used them before. As you can see, I just opened the package, but I'm gonna use them. back this one's awful tight on my thumb but I burnt my thumb and my pointer finger already so that's why I have them on those fingers
I still want to touch it with my finger. <laughs> oh, why? I am kind of putting a little hot glue here and there as I go, just to hold it good and tight together. Did you see me try and use my finger that doesn't have a finger protector on it? Oh my goodness. Pay attention, pay attention. Okay guys, check this out. <laughs> I think it is amazing. John's home, the boys are here, Chase and Brennan that is, my two youngest boys, <laughs> and they think it's pretty cool too. So, I know this looks a little funky right there if you look at it that way, but when it's hanging up on my porch, you're not gonna see that part. And right here, you can just like adjust these however you like them, which I'll do after I'm completely finished because I'm gonna put a little bit of an embellishment on this and I'm gonna do the black one exactly the same as I did this one. And when I'm all finished, I'm gonna show you guys what they look like. Stay tuned. Okay guys, here they are. I know the lighting isn't great. You can see my shadow, <laughs> but this is what I'm working with. We got sunrise coming up back here. So here they are, his and hers, which is brooms. You guys know that our vehicles are broken down, right? Well, we needed rides. We needed rides. <laughs> There's my shadow. See the lighting, it's bad. Let me try to get over here. <laughs> I'm not a professional, guys. Not a professional. But look at this. I love these. Here they are, and let me try and get a little close up of the bottoms really quick if I can. Alright guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow.